Hey guys, I hope you're enjoying this really beautiful day. Temperature feels fantastic, really. <sighs> Slight cool breeze, which I love. Love feeling it flow across my skin. Anyway, I wanted to take a few minutes to share with you. I have shared, for those of you who have seen it before, I've shared a, a little tiny snippet of our past financial story some uh, a situation we had where I mean, we were we were below the hole a few years ago but we're still here kicking now so whatever you have going on financially gets through it pass through it you're, you're still going to be here to, to go kicking well I want to add to that today because um, I, I had a friend of mine a few friends. A friend in a video gave me a message this morning, and then I've had a couple of other friends that that also confirmed that some things we've had happen in the past couple of weeks are just, as they called it in their own words, it was just madness. So friends, if you've got some madness going on right now, please hang in there. Because listen, for me, and Jesse's past two weeks or less, a little, little piece of what has been going on in my life. I had um, one of my own sons, flesh and blood, um, he has, I'll be honest, he has anger issues, drug issues, and, and one day he took, he, he came from behind, knocked me to the ground off guard, and, and started beating beating on my head in front of my 12 year old and 7 year old. Some of you have seen the bruise under my eye, black eye and all so yeah that's where it came from. Went to the hospital that night made sure nothing else was damaged. Uh, I had to take the step of filing an EPO on him and uh, my own mom thought I was wrong for doing so but you know I had to I was worried about the safety of not only myself, but also my other kids. Anyway, that's one piece. A couple days after that, that same child's mom had me put in jail for a night. So just within the past couple weeks, I spent the night in jail. You know what? I'm here. Right now, with you, I'm sharing. I've gone through it. I went through it. I did not stay there. I did not dwell there. And that's the point that I'm making with sharing this right now. Every single morning when we wake up, we have the choice of thinking about all the bad things, thinking, and then speaking and seeing all the bad things that are revolving around us. Or every single morning we have the choice of thinking, seeing, and speaking the good things that are happening. Even with all the madness that's been going on in my life, and that was just two little things in the past couple of weeks among a bunch of other things that my close friends know about, even among that serious madness, I have blessings in my life. The night that I was sitting in jail, laying in jail, actually, I was dwelling, thinking on the blessings that I have. Even, even that night away from my family, I was laying there making the, the, the decision to be thankful for the family that I have, for the, for the love that I feel from all of you guys too. And, and missing the fact that I couldn't talk to you, I couldn't share with you, and I couldn't receive feedback from you. I have blessings. You have blessings, no matter what you're going through right now. And I know all of us are going through something, so I know you're going through something. No matter what you're going through, focus forward. This is about you. It's you against you. You see me using that hashtag all the time. It's you against you. We are in this together. You and me. From my heart to yours, we are in this together. We got this. The battle is ours. We got this. I love you guys. Have a beautiful day.